Hi guys, what is going on? It is Deathwish here bringing you a GTA video. In this video, we are going to be discussing a bug that me and Sam Rocketman found while selling my 16 crate warehouse. Before we go into the topic, I would like to apologise for not getting a video up in the last couple of days. I've been really ill. I started off to be a really bad throat, then it turned into a stinking cold. You can probably tell by my voice that I've still got the cold, but I think I'm well enough to actually let you guys know about this little bug just in case you come across it in the future there is a way to avoid it so stick with the video and we will let you know how to avoid it so my 16 crate warehouse was full and then i invited rocket in to help me with the sale and it came up that we had to go to the airfield and get into a plane and then do 10 drops each normally it comes up with 10 yellow dots on your map because you have to do 10 drops each but in this case, it come up with more than 10. I think Rocket's dots were added to my map and my dots were added to Rocket's map. It, it was really confusing. That was the first thing that we noticed. So normally when you're doing a drop like this, you've got little flares that let you know where to drop uh, the packages. And then that's also a yellow dot on your map. But the second thing we noticed was there were flares on the actual city but there was no yellow waypoint on the dot. So that was quite weird. I don't know if that was because Rocket already made a delivery, but normally when you make a delivery, the flare goes out and then the waypoint disappears on the map. The third thing we noticed was you couldn't deliver to all the waypoints. So you find a waypoint on your map, uh, you fly through the flare. Normally you press right on the D-pad on the controller and then it dropped the package. But it wasn't coming up in the top right hand corner to say press right on the D-pad. Normally it doesn't tell you to press right because you're flying too high. But that wasn't the case with us because we were quite low to the ground. And it, it just wouldn't let us drop the packages. Another thing that we noticed is that Rocket was doing deliveries. And in the bottom right hand corner where it actually tells you how many deliveries were made. Um, it wasn't counting rockets deliveries i mean it counted free but he made like seven deliveries by the time it actually counted free so it was only counting for certain drops i don't know if that was because he was delivering to my waypoints um i have no idea when i was in my plane the same thing was happening it was telling me that i couldn't drop to that waypoint i managed to do all my drops before it told me that i can't make any more drops rocket only managed to make three drops and then it told him that he can't deliver anymore. He, he physically couldn't press right on the D-pad. The sign wasn't coming up so he can drop. So he landed and then I finished my drop. And he wanted me to get into his plane to see if it worked for me. By the way guys, I am terrible at flying in GTA. I can't fly. It's really annoying. Um, I, I need so much more practice. It's unbelievable. I don't fly because I know I can't fly. So this mission was a little bit dodgy. Anyway, I got into Rocket's plane after... A really bad landing by me and I went to the nearest drop and it physically didn't let me do any more drops and then the time ran out and then we only got paid for the amount of drops that we did we sent a message to Rockstar on the Rockstar support website and told them what happened they got back to us a couple of hours later and asked how much money we lost we told them and then we got a refund we looked online as well to see if any other people were having this problem or if it was just us. We looked on the GTA Reddit page and we did actually notice that other people were having the same problem as well with uh, the planes bugging out and not letting anyone drop packages to the waypoints. And then we come across a, a sort of fix. So once you go into your computer and uh, go to sell for the warehouse, it spawns you outside the warehouse. Your assistant comes up and tells you to head to the airfield and then get in a plane and do drops. If this happens, just go to online and then find new session and then that will take you into a brand new session. You don't lose all your crates, but you might lose a couple. Um, I think on a 16 crate warehouse, you lose two crates, which will cost you 8k to do another delivery but it's only one more delivery and then you can sell i'm not too sure if this is a new thing because people are changing sessions while doing a sale i don't know if they've like recently added it or something but it's an extra 8k and you get a totally different mission i don't think um they will ever give you the same mission twice in a row if they do then that's just really bad luck but i'm sure you can just go to options and then find a new session again 
is so much better than losing the wholesale from the warehouse. There we are guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I hope this video helps if you do do the, the crates from the warehouse and you didn't know how to avoid the plain one. There are like four different types of missions. You've got the, the big plain one where you have to do five drops, only four show up on the map and then uh, the fifth one is the protected area and then you get someone to chase you or you get helicopters after you when you do the last one. That one's easy though, you can just uh, fly out to sea and then they don't chase you anymore and then mission completed. There are easy ones where you've got two trucks and then you just drive and then make two deliveries and you've also got the boats where you have to do five drops and you normally got two boats. Like I said guys, I apologise for not getting a video up sooner or not getting this video up sooner but I've been really ill, you could probably tell in my voice in this video but we done it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave me a comment if this has happened to you or if this helped you out. And until my next video, guys, I will catch you later.